the Simper Ethernet is the perfect solution for real-time system and control of devices for high speed as a flight simulator required. The car uses last generation technology. So, in this way, a Simper Ethernet contains in one unique car the equivalent of four usual cards using other USB conventional systems. Let's see a configuration example. One SIM card Ethernet plus four extension daughter cards are simply enough to control a fuel overhead, including all their gauges. We can have as many extension daughter cards as we want. The connection between the SIM card Ethernet and extension daughter cards is as easy as using a 10-way flat cable. The response time of SYNC or Ethernet is 10 times faster than the traditional USB. So, no encoder pulse will be lost as far as you move it the fastest possible, increasing the feelings of realism in the simulator. The SYNC or Ethernet is programmable in multiple languages which can be chosen by the user. C, S, C, SCAL, and so on. Let's go to connect this display, a switch, and an enunciator. Everything without welding. Let's see. Remember that a USB cable cannot be longer than 2 meters to a partner functioning. However, Ethernet allows around 100 meters without losing any data, and even the use of wireless. That is the JIT card which is used to connect the components and modules without any weld. Easy, clean and reliable connection that provides a better service. Next, the elements of a complex local network are shown below. We have a router connected to a switch with 8 Ethernet ports free. The router allows the connection to internet. The switch allows communicating with all the devices which are connected to it through an Ethernet cable. That is, computers, SIM card Ethernet, router, and so on. Let's go to connect the first device to the switch, a laptop for example. The SIM card Ethernet must be supplied with 5 DC volts power supply. Connect also the Ethernet card to the switch. Once it is connected, we can say that the Ethernet card and the laptop have an interlaced communication. And the switch is the joint element of this local network. Now, let's run the SFIPSCAL application on the laptop in order to the Ethernet card can be recognized. SFIPSCAL can be found for free at the download section through Sysmo webpage. 
finally, check that the SIM card Ethernet is recognized and that the components connected to it interact with the SC Pascal application which we previously installed on the laptop. This configuration process of the SIM card Ethernet can be done with any other computer which is connected to the switch. Let's see other example with a desktop computer. Again, we recognize the SIM card Ethernet but now it is controlled by the new computer added to the network through the switch. Use the SC Pascal application for checking the proper functioning of the display connected to the Ethernet card. The last demonstration is to connect another laptop through our wireless and local network, getting the same connection result with the SIM card Ethernet. Let's place other display which we can manage from the laptop via wireless. <laughs> 